Hi guys, I'm just here doing a little stitching for a family member. Now what happens is he has a trigger finger and he has bought um, splint online to wear. However, when he's up and about during the daytime, it's not very easy to move his finger around so he, he can actually use his hand like he wants to use it. So I thought I could make him some splints so that it would be more flexible and he would be able to move his finger around and he would be better able to use his hand so the finger was not just so stiff. So I decided to take some vinyl and cut strips and then get his finger measurement and get the little DIY splints just high enough on the finger so that it stabilizes the joint However, he's still able to bend the finger somewhat so that he can do his daily chores. Here is my family member's hand with his DIY trigger finger fix. But not only is he able Treatment. to do his chores, but this DIY splint actually acts as a treatment and help his finger to heal because it stabilizes the finger so the finger does not trigger and because it doesn't trigger constantly it doesn't get inflamed and so because there's no inflammation it helps to heal the finger so this little thing here can actually be a treatment for your trigger finger if this video was helpful to you please give a thumbs up share and leave a comment be below if you have trigger finger or know somebody with trigger finger who you have told about this little diy trigger finger fix let me know about it and let me know if it helped you at all thank you so much for watching the video if you're watching this video and you have a subscribe, please remember to subscribe before you leave so you can get lots of tips and tricks for yourself, for your home, for your garden, and lessons from my design studio. You take care now and I'll see you for the next video.